collateral. Why? Because we've been living in this different world. So that's why when I'm telling you about Parthenogenesis, Parthenogenesis, that you can't probably grasp it. Get in your head that our goddesses don't, they never need a dick to impregnate. Everything in the universe sprung from divine feminine energy. And masculine energy comes from divine, from the feminine energy. Masculine energy was always here too though. But it was always the feminine energy first. The feminine created the masculine energy. It's before we even, in, even incarnated into any form of existence. It was just all dark matter energy. And none but before it was a Anunnaki goddess, before it was a Most High, any of that, it was just all dark matter energy. That which we are. It was nothing, not even us. And then because this dark matter energy is feminine, that's what make her creative. Creativity is the part of the feminine side of you. So it was just all darkness, dark matter energy in the beginning. And the reason that this dark matter energy started to become creative is because it was feminine. Feminine energy births. Only feminine energy births. Masculine energy don't birth. Masculine energy protects. Masculine energy dictates. Masculine energy provides whatever the feminine energy needs. This is why the man is the provider and protector of the household. God, that's what your job is. Because masculine energy provides and protects the feminine source that it was created from. And it does and it, it enforces whatever law the feminine source dictates. So that's why it was dark matter energy. And the darkness was the masculine energy. Remember I said it was dark matter energy. Nowadays in science, because, you know, they don't understand us. This shit coming from here. You don't see no textbooks right here. Don't need it. Who you think this is speaking through me right now? I'm just the vessel. Hear me clearly. Science don't even understand this shit I'm telling y'all right now. They call dark matter energy antimatter or antimatter. That's the same shit that was made, that the Venom suit was made of in Spider-Man. That was antimatter, or should I say, dark matter energy. And they can't control it, so they scared of it. But to us, it's us. We balance with it and flow with it. That's what they fear. The dark matter energy source we come from. So understand it was just dark matter energy. And the reason that the energy was dark was that's the masculine energy. Because it's providing and protecting the feminine source. So that's why energy was dark. It could have been any color, but the first color was darkness. All colors come from black because masculine energy is black. Why you think crystals, all protection crystals are going to be black? Because masculine energy is black. It provides and protects and enforces. Why do you think police carry black wands? Because they know that. They're the original slave catchers. So the, uh, the, the elites who created this law enforcement to enforce their agenda was trying to replicate the, the enforcement of the dark matter energy. The police baton that, that they beat motherfuckers with could have been any color. Why was it black? Because it's trying to, they trying to enforce. And darkness enforces because darkness is masculine energy. That's what made it dark. And it provides and protects and enforces. And when the police, they trying to what? Enforce. 
So they got the black sticks, they got the black bibs, they got the black belts, they got black guns. That's why they even make guns black. So it was just dark matter energy. That's the masculine side of it. That's what make it aggressive. That's, that's, the, that's the masculine concept. That's what make it dark. But then the feminine energy was the one that said, create this. So the feminine energy spoke to the masculine energy and the masculine energy started to, because it has to enforce. It started to enforce what the feminine principle told it. And out of that enforcement, the Anunnaki goddesses was created. Okay? Our, our Anunnaki goddesses were created. Our Most High, our Supreme Council was created because our black women manifested themselves out of dark matter energy. But I had to explain to you what dark matter energy really was before I could tell you that next part. Naz be watching me and all this shit. I'm telling y'all, I didn't got emails before from motherfuckers from NASA. Like, hey, can you tell us this? Or how you know this? And I don't tell them shit. They be mad because they can't use me. See what I'm saying?